We are talking about one of the most anticipated stories of the day, the new first dog. That's right, Tiffany. The Obama's new Portuguese water dog, Bo, is expected to move into the White House today. And here with two of our very own Portuguese water dogs is Lana Gretsch, pet expert and owner. It's a dog's life. Well, so good to see you. Hi, yeah, Spooky. Nice to Thanks see you. for having me, So guys. tell us about these two little guys right here. Well, this is Splash and this is Diver. And they're Portuguese water dogs. And they're really excited that a cousin of theirs is going to be in the White House. <laughs> Can you tell us a little bit about this breed? Sure. Portuguese water oh. dogs are one of oh. the... Oh, they see themselves. Look at <laughs> They're one of the oldest breeds of domesticated dogs dating all the way back to the 13th century. Um, they make fantastic pets and companions. They're intelligent, they're highly trainable, yeah. they have really lovely temperaments, and they are hypoallergenic, which was really important. In were you surprised when the uh, the first family picked a Portuguese water dog as their first dog? We were actually really excited. Portuguese water dogs are super charismatic, and we just thought they, their temperament would make them such a great presidential pet. And then with the, Malia has allergies, so this is perfect. Are they, these are allergen-free dogs? Oh, they're not allergen-free, but they're very low allergy. They have a single hey. coat of hair, mm -hmm. so they don't <laughs> shed at all. Uh -huh. um, and their hair tends to grow like human hair, so again, they don't shed, and uh, it helps with people with allergies to avoid the dander. Absolutely. All right, let's talk about other presidential first dogs, right, guys? Yeah. Uh, what do you think about George W. Bush, John? We were talking about this, and uh, Barney, you remember that? Barney had like the Scottish Terrier. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Feisty yeah. little dogs, <laughs> kind of like feisty George Bush. Yeah, they were cool. <laughs> yeah. I love all dogs. You I love really all do. dogs too. Do. What do you think about Sasha and Malia getting a water dog? Well, I think it's a good idea. Yeah. I mean, like you know, everybody's giving the Obamas like such a hard time about everything. If she's allergic, they they want a dog. I mean, I'm the responsibility has yeah. got to be to your daughter. Mm -hmm. So. Absolutely. Absolutely. I yeah, think they're doing people, a great job. And her health. Yeah, yeah, people were upset that it wasn't from a shelter. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. I think but the I guess. spirit was there, but, you know, the reality was something else. Yeah, Cut absolutely. them some slack, Jack. How about <laughs> you, cat lover girl? Look, I'm waiting for the first cat. To take. <laughs> Wait, wasn't there a first cat? Who had a cat? Chelsea Clinton. Chelsea she had a cat. Yeah, Chelsea she had the socks. It wasn't the real socks. They, still had a, right. they still have a dog, though. I want just a, a cat. In the house, that's it. A first I'll cat, no first dog. No first dog. <laughs> it should be a multi-pet household. Dog. Yes, hamster, squirrel, snake. Why not? A snake. You never know what the next president's going to bring in. <laughs> well, speaking of the Clintons, they had the cat, but they had Buddy the dog, who was very Buddy. popular. Buddy was very cute. We have a picture chocolate of Buddy. Chocolate lab, right? Yeah, chocolate lab. Very cute, but Buddy, didn't Buddy, like, it was super sad. Yeah, yeah, but yeah it was super sad. Wrapped up, up in the uh, Chappaqua. <coughs> yeah, yes. it was like, bye, Buddy. Yeah. Rest in peace. He survived the White House and then in retirement. It didn't end out so good. Poor Buddy. Oh. Chappaqua is his last resting yeah. place. All right, let's talk about um, just some of the difficulties. Can you imagine having a dog running around the White House? I mean, they, <laughs> this dog has to be trained, right? Absolutely. Chenny is going to be an imperative part of getting Bo set up to, uh, to his new lifestyle. They really need to start and focus on socialization for him. Mm -hmm. There's going to be so many different people, children, excitement going on in the White House, and we need Bo to feel comfortable with all of these surroundings. Are these guys Are they, groomed right now? I just got to ask. Do they get um, really, really hairy, or is this pretty they, much how they This look? is a little bit of a shortcut. This is what they call the retriever cut for the Portuguese mm. water dog. It allows them to swim well, doesn't get in the way, and it's a great cut, again, for allergies because the shorter the hair is, the less, There's less dander and everything shedding. like that, and less shedding. They're What's like little the, people, those little guys, are. aren't they? they have beautiful faces. What are their temperaments like, like with children? Generally, very sweet natured. <laughs> Portuguese water dogs are very high energy, but once trained, really can focus and adjust to their lifestyle. So, if they're taught to be around children and socialize to them early on, mm -hmm. their temperament will be just to accept them. And mm -hmm. that's again why socialization mm -hmm. is going to be so important. Mm -hmm. for so that training, huh? Puppy. Elena Gretsch, thank you so much coming. Uh, for coming in, and happy birthday to you. Oh, yeah, thank, thank you so much. Exactly. Exactly. Good morning with us. Yeah. Yes. Happy <laughs> Don't go away, folks, because we will be right back. Something way